God damn, that's some real ass music right there. But um, I got oh, I got the voice volume turned on, so I'm gonna be able to listen to people talking. You're listening to people talking right now. Um, play with my boy Fruit Booter and some bare bones. What's good? It looks like it's just me and him right now. Uh oh. Uh oh. Too bad we're the Merkers. 2v2? What the hell is this? Some game battle shit or something? Hell no. Nah. But uh, we and him, I told him to put the RPD in. Me and him, we're just gonna mob around some RPDs. And I'm gonna teach you guys how to use an LMG right now, alright? Because uh, a lot of people think Sleight of Hand is the right perk to use. Some people think Scavenger is the right perk to use. Wrong and more wrong. I'm gonna show you, both of us just missed that jump. <laughs> we both tried jumping across that roof and we're both too fat asses who can't handle it. But um, I hear these guys across, so I'm gonna do a little masturbator. You know, just lure them in a little bit. Uh, I talked about this already. Uh, I might have talked about it. I'm not sure if I'm gonna post the gameplay where I talk about the masturbator <laughs> before this or after this. But uh, yep, again, and his friend's gonna want some revenge. I believe it's his friend. But someone's gonna get fucked up. And, um, here we go. So, uh, we got some more people on our team. Barebones Pro, it's interesting gameplay, I think, because if I get, let's say I get 30 kills in this, and then I get 30 kills in normal team deathmatch, there's a good chance that, like, 10 around, I don't know, maybe not 10, but, uh, maybe, like, five or anywhere from five to ten kills are gonna be air support kills and in bare bones since it's only um since it's only gun kills or weapon kills i guess then you're gonna you're gonna see tw like 30 actual gun kills so it's more entertaining just because you're gonna see me killing more people with my actual gun only thing that sucks is that it's 4v4 so it's a little bit slower pace but um I kind of like it. It's cool. Um, steady aim on this class was a mistake. Uh, put ninja on. That guy fucking whipped me with the the heartbeat sensor earlier. And um, there's nothing worse than getting killed by someone with a heartbeat sensor. It just sucks. So just remember, use a ninja. No perk is really that good in the yellow area. If you're using ninja, just what are you doing? Come on, dude. Steady and have you guys noticed that steady aim is like built in commando into it? That's crazy. But check this out. I'm doing the one man army. Throwing claymores everywhere. So basically what I'm gonna do, the tactic I'm utilizing in this gameplay would be one man arming, reload the reason I use one man army, I'll explain that in the first place, is because with the normal oh there's my boy Rob, he got in here. Um when you reload without sleight of hand, it's oh with sleight of hand, the one man army pro and there's only pro, all right. So it has to be one man army pro if you want this to happen like this. One man army pro reloads, I think the same time, maybe a little bit longer, maybe a little bit shorter, but it's around the same amount of time. One man army will, and plus you don't only reload your gun, but you reload your claymores, reload everything. So it's basically like having scavenger. Because you have as many claymores, you have all the ammo you need, have all that stuff. Um, yeah, you have your claymores, you have your... Sorry, someone called me and I got distracted for a second. But this sucks. Steady aim fucked me over right here. It just... That was stupid. <laughs> my friend Robin just said, No wonder why I'm not getting my kill streaks." He didn't realize we are playing bare bones. Um... Yeah, you can reload everything. So it's basically combining sleight of hand when you're using only when you're using an LMG because any gun can reload faster than this. But it reloads pretty quick. I get all my stuff. I get a fresh smoke grenade, and I put smoke grenade on here so I can hide when I reload my class if I have to. And smoke grenades. I've been getting into smoke grenades a lot lately just because they are a lot more useful than people think they are. You can, especially if you do a little combo action. Like I use like I like the bear thermal a lot. It's just like my favorite sniper intervention. <laughs> Um, FMJ is obsolete. That thing is a hit marker machine. It does nothing good for you. 
it's all about the bear right now. And you might say the bear gets more hit markers than the intervention. Yeah, but the intervention takes in, like fucking another extra second just to cock back your bolt. The bear it, blap, blap, done. And I just like to keep like that. I like to keep a high powered pistol on my sniper classes, like the Desert Eagle, just so I can, um, if I need to, I can give them the one hitter quitter if I get a hit marker on them in close range. So, um,. I don't know what just happened there. It sounded like he shot because I saw a red dot on the map, but then I looked and he uses running and tack knife for me. So that sucks. I'm a little mad. I got tack knife, so I'm gonna set up some claymores in this building, or just gonna set up some claymores around here, just so I can um. I don't know. It's just free kills basically. I mean, I got the one man army just to reload my gun, but you know, why don't you utilize it to its maximum potential and call me a new for using the one man army claymores? I don't care. It's a good tactic. And it works well. Um, if they are upset about that, they could have easily put on the Overwatch class, which has sit rep on it. So that's that's their own fault because um, there's pretty much a counter for everything in this game besides Commando. I think Commando is the one thing that has no counter at close range because you'll get slapped up even if you have a shotgun. This is, it gives you and it's slight. It gives you like an equal chance then. But the commander with the marathon lightweight, it's just, if you don't have a shotgun, you're fucked. You're pretty much just fucked. If they're tax snipers, um, I guess use an AA or a st whatever shotgun you feel most comfortable with. I prefer rangers just because it's high output of power. Right now, this guy gets a claymore planted on his ho ass. He sees me jump, look at the shadow. <laughs> yeah. But, um... Yeah, there's usually a counter for everything in this game, so try getting creative. Uh, my whole thing is getting creative now. Oh, I saved that guy's life. He was reloading and freaking came in there. They're both reloading, I guess. And this is um, a little bit more masturbator. So uh, luring them into this barber shop, making it hot, putting claimers all over the place. And um, see if they come in there, get me a kill maybe. Um, yeah, so right now I'm just... Uh, I'm just listening for people basically, I hear this guy, turn, take him out. Uh, on this, whew. on this map, you want to stay, um, kind of at a higher elevation. The rooftops are definitely the most advantageous spot on this map. I hear that guy running down the hallway, take him out. Um, and I fall out this window and I go for this guy. Or, wait, did I miss, oh, uh, there. Got that guy? Got lucky because he had an AA-12. I'm so surprised he didn't get me. He just had slow reaction time. Oh, um, this game. All right, yeah, I fall out the window right here, and it's just because I, I don't know my hit, my steady aim is just a waste of a perk for this gun. I'm telling you, just use ninja and always aim down sight. I saw that this guy had uh, last stand in the kill cam, so I saw him for earlier maybe, but I knew he had last stand, so that's why I jumped out and uh, killed him like that. Always be very. Ad Attentive or at attentive? I don't even know how to say that. I don't want to say anything, do I? In my commentaries, I'm always saying that. I don't know how to say that. I don't know how to say that. I guess I'm just a stupid person. Um, I do play video games a lot. No, I'm just joking. I'm not stupid. Um, just moving around. Uh, I'm looking for this. I heard him in here, and I was looking for where he's at, but Fruit Booter takes him out. Does him dirty. I think he threw knife him. Oh, no, never mind. He uh, took him out with the Tar 21. Uh, yeah, just listening around pretty much. I don't know. It's pretty basic stuff. Um, that's all, I guess that's the only time during this gameplay that City Aim helped me out. I'm moving around. They're spawning towards the A domination side because my team is on the opposite side. They might be spawning street now. So I'm um, kind of keeping an eye from street to A domination area. Just moving back and forth in between there. See this guy jump across, take him out easily, and um, with the unsilenced weapon, you really want to um, be l watching your back when you're shooting because an unsilenced weapon is just as good as a silenced weapon is as when you're like rushing. So when you're not rushing, an unsilenced weapon is actually it's really good. I didn't see that guy back into the little cubby slot, and um, I paid for it. Because if I waited it out, he uh, would have walked into my claymore, or I could have flanked him and taken him out. But, you know, he got his revenge from when I slapped his ass earlier. And, uh, yeah, just keep my claymores up. And this is great. The people are nowhere near me, but I'm putting up claymores just because, you know, I have the class, I have the 
I have the um just the equipment to do it and I got the resources I guess so put my claymores up then move away and the reason I move away is because people tend to spawn your own team tend to spawn around you so if I move away my team will probably spawn around me um to get them away from that area so the team so the enemy team might move into that area and walk through some of my claymores like that and um and yeah that was uh I don't get any more gun kills. I'm just looking around for the last 10 seconds. Bare Bones is kind of slow paced just because the 4v4, no kill streaks. So it usually doesn't get the last kill and doesn't get to the end. But um, it's still entertaining because I get a lot of gun kills, a lot of equipment kills, or whatever you want to say. But um, yeah, that was just a tactic how to use an LMG. So go to utilize that if you like that. But I'll see you guys later. Peace.